I think the only way to have fun with this is to do illegal shit. Like bikers would do. Oh, man. Oh! <laughs> First five seconds in and we die. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to Life Of here in Grand Theft Auto 5. We are here using our good friend Franklin and we're going to do the life of a motorcycle rider. Now we're going to take a street bike out on the road and we're going to go dipping in and out of traffic. We're going to have some casual conversation and uh, it should be fun. I used to do this just by myself without recording because I think it's interesting with the amount of speed and danger that people put into doing this type of activity on uh, in real life. So we're going to go ahead and participate in that same thing. We're going to go ahead and be in first person. Give us that nice, uh, immersed feel. Really nice fucking flame helmet going on. So we already got our outfit on, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a nice ride into, or not into, but, uh, to the tip of the island somewhere of Los Santos. We're gonna do a nice 15-20 minute ride. We're gonna be here on a Batty, R Batty 801, not an RR. Um, but yeah, here we go. So we're gonna get this started. So really quick, I'm, I, I should have done this before, but I kind of forgot. I want to make this go as fast as possible. So let's go ahead and get this whole thing tricked out. Just with engine modifications. Oh, Jesus Christ, that was fast. Just with engine modifications. We'll go ahead and get it started. Now, I guess we could figure out early if we're, if we're gonna be a good biker or are we gonna be a bad biker. I think the only way to have fun with this is to do illegal shit. Like bikers would do. Oh, man. Oh! <laughs> First five seconds in and we die. <laughs> there it is. Seems legit. Obama's cousin, Ralph. My God. Absolutely ridiculous. I can't, I don't even have anything to say to that. So much for a casual ride, huh? Fucking A. All right, so we're back here on the road after that violent, violent crash. <laughs> yeah, that is a beautiful way to start it off. Uh, obviously, motorcycle riders don't have that type of flexibility when it comes to getting knocked off the bike and living to tell about it, and I think that's where the accident happened right there. So we're going to try to get on the freeway. It's a lot safer for us to be on the freeway uh, than anything. And yes, uh, just we are going to lane split most of the time. Lane splitting is legal. Uh, a lot of people think that it is not. I'm not sure about other play- whoa, what a douchebag. A lot of people in other uh, states and stuff, I'm not sure if that's legal, but in California, lane splitting like this, riding the white line. Oh, running a red almost in front of a sheriff officer. Shit. Or a sheriff deputy, not an officer. Go ahead and back it up a little so that way we're behind the thing. It is definitely a pretty crazy feeling uh, having first person on a bike. I mean, it's almost like you're immersed in the thing because this is what it would feel like. You have the bike underneath you, you have pedestrians to the left and right. She is jamming, man. Oh man, she was jamming. Oh, this is fun. This is already fun. Even though we started it off with a quick death, this is fun. Oh man, are they coming in behind us? Shit's gonna get real if they are. There we go. We're on the freeway now, now we're gonna start our, uh, our ride out to the northernmost end of Los Santos. Wow, this is gonna get bad. Oh, that guy just jerked to the side. Okay, hitting some traffic here. Oh my god, truck's going ham. Oh my god. Okay, we gotta. The, the drivers, man, are fucking ridiculous in this game. Alright, we gotta get around them. There we go, we're smooth sailing. We're gonna lane split right here. There we go. Woo. Okay. We are gunning it right now, man. This bike actually sounds really good. And ew, it's kind of enjoyable to... It's scary though. I gotta admit, if I did this in real life, I'd probably shit myself at least once or twice at the beginning. It would be pretty bad. So we're still lane splitting. We got a free lane over here to the right, so we're just for safety reasons gonna stay over to the right because these people like to switch lanes without signaling or anything. I have a feeling it's going to happen like with one of these big trucks. We'll be smooth sailing. Next thing we know, we'll get taken out. All right, we're going to cut around to the right and we'll cut back in. There we go. 
So yeah, we're just going to make our way to the north end. If it doesn't take that long, uh, honestly, we'll probably end up going back into town. Almost just hit like a coyote or something while uh, on a bike. That not that would not be good at all, actually. That would be probably really bad for a bike bicyclist, uh, bicyclist, a biker to hit uh, animal while it's crossing the road. Man, this shit is scary. And the attention to detail is even worse because you cannot make one screw up. Just like the beginning where I almost went around that one car and then I didn't make it. That's exactly the attention to detail I need when doing this. Oh my God, this is crazy, dude. I'm going 151 miles per hour through traffic right now. Oh my God, what are you doing? Okay, okay, oh. Shit, dude, this is crazy. 140, 145, 150. Keep it, keep it. You don't have that room for air. Oh, okay, keep it together. You're on a street bike. Oh my God, I am cutting it up right now, guys. This is insane. Now tell me if you guys like this and you want to see more episodes of Street Bike. Like, we can we can sit there and we can go through just really cool places. I'll get some dirt bikes. I want to do a motocross one. Uh, that would definitely be fun. Try to find some like dirt bike locations. I know they have some around here. Look, we've already made it to the northernmost end of the island because of this street bike. Have we? Yeah, we're about there, I think. Actually, maybe not. Hold on. Yeah, we are at the northernmost end of the fucking Los Santos. That is how you do it. So really quick, we'll just go take a look over here at the... Uh, that's the second bike after the first one got totaled. Uh, I had to get a new bike. I like the paint scheme of the other one, though. This is a nice view we got here that literally only took us five minutes, not even, to get out here. I thought it always would take longer than that, but... You know, I guess we'll cut it up some more. Just, uh, you know, embrace the view for a few seconds. Definitely try to go do some water sports. Wink, wink. No, just kidding. Uh, definitely got some more ideas for episodes. I want to do flying and stuff. So Life Of is going to get pretty crazy, guys. I have a lot of ideas for this. Um, and I'm actually having fun. You guys are seeming to enjoy it. I got some more hunting I want to do. Better locations. You guys definitely left me some pretty good locations for hunting. So I'm going to go ahead and sneak past these guys. We're going to get going. We're going to try to make it back into merging. Holy shit, that car is supposed to merge over. Go ahead and slow it down a little because we're going. There we go, we're good. So we're head back into Los Santos, back to Franklin's house. We'll go ahead and get our GPS open right now. That way we know exactly where to go. Oh my god, that was it. That was almost it right there. Okay, clear, clear. Shit, man, that could have been really bad. Ride that line. Oh my god. We need to get on the right side. Or the left side. This side. That way I can kind of wa ride this yellow. And have a cushion between these fuckers. Because they're going to hit me off going this fast. Shit man. This is scary. This is what they do though in real life. They cut it up. Oh man. This... I'm getting so into it that it's even hard to talk at some moments. Because I know if I talk, I'm going to hit something. Oh my god, that was close right there. Semi, going around. Oh, so close that it literally, I, I skimmed it and it took me out of first person. That's how close I was on that truck. My god. I had a feeling like it wanted to kill me, but it just didn't. This is fun though. If you want to get an experience, this is what you should do in a game because... This is as close as it gets without actually dying. You know, of course, like, you know. Oh my god! Oh my god, what a jackass! That is how people die. Semi trucks being complete douchebags. Even though I shouldn't be doing this. Oh, you know what we're gonna do? We are gonna cut it up in the wilderness, uh, not the wilderness, but the windy back roads. This is gonna be fun. This is definitely gonna be fun. Oh my god, biker versus biker. Okay, shit's getting real. I'm not, I'm not sure how to operate on these windy roads. I gotta get used to it. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, continue straight. That way we can go into the heart of where these windy roads are. Man, it's getting a lot more crazy with these roads. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and hit a right. Make our way up. Fuck, I don't know how to turn. Like, the bike doesn't have that great of turning radius. So it's very difficult to maneuver it on some turns. 
Like, I have a feeling that, oh my god, that truck almost went into my lane. Fucking asshole. So this isn't more laid back. This is more, I guess, well, oh my god. Holy shit, man. I lost total control and went straight for a sign, and thank god the sign was tall enough to where I was able to slide underneath it. We're gonna go on this side. My god, man. This is exactly what these guys must go through when they're biking all crazy like this. Because I've had some close calls. Even started it out with a fucking close call that turned to death. Oh my... Right there. Right fucking there, guys. Holy shit. That could have been another close one. We're going to slow it down. I'm a little scared now. We're going like 70 in residentials. Holy shit. I had some close calls. I'm surprised I started it off with a death if I'm making it through those ones. What is that? No, come on, man. I just got that bike. Oh. Somebody stop that guy. Someone just stole a bike. Hey, what's up, man? Give the bike back. All right, you know what? Looks like we're gonna have to take care of this guy. This is one of our biking buddies. He just got his bike stolen, so I got a Glock. You don't know who you're fucking stay with, dude. You wanna stay the- oh, That's right. Oh. Franklin's a thug, motherfucker. This. This shit oh. We'll go ahead and we're gonna do this old school. Remember, it's Franklin versus this guy. Oh, I just shot him and ran him over. That was a two-in-one special right there. The guy wants me to turn his bike back to him, but, uh... I'm not gonna do that. I don't got time. I just wanted to help him. We got the thug off the streets. Franklin's a good guy. We get back to our business. Cutting it up. I hit the right! Oh my god, I'm so sorry, dude. What'd you say to me? What'd you say to me? Don't ever talk to me, okay? You hear me? You better follow. You better recognize. Alright, we're out of here. Try to cut it up a little more. Oh, we gotta get back to Franklin's house. That's right, we have a destination we gotta go to. See, we're gonna cut, we're gonna run this. This is why I like bikes, because you have a lot more maneuverability. Oh, fucking dick. You know what? Well, it is Franklin, so we gotta thug out. We can't just, uh, let people do this. Hey, let's do this thing! Remember, Franklin is a thug, and you must let a thug breathe. I have no idea where that came from. <laughs> I have no idea where that came from at all. Oh my god. Yeah, I don't think I could sit here. If I was a bike and I had the ability to just do this right here, check my corners. Oh fuck, that could have been bad. Like this. A car could not do that without risking, like, major injury to its... I mean, even a biker is risking injury, but they have a lot quicker engine. The biker's uh, lighter, so it gets them A to B, like right here, right here. That's exactly what I would love to do in real life, but that's so dangerous. Here we go again. We're about five or ten minutes away from Franklin's. Actually, not even that far, probably. Oh, we got... What's this? Another... We're gonna be a good Samaritan. Hey, it looks like we gotta get this guy and help her out. What's up, dude? Franklin does not play. It's it's the right to bear arms, people. Civilians have to have the chance to fight back. It's as simple as that. And you can only do that if you're armed and simple as that. I mean, I don't I don't know where else I was gonna go with that. I mean, you can't just expect to fight a criminal with a gun and not have one. It's not gonna work that way. All right. Oh, taking your fucking helmet off. Done with that helmet? Yep, leave it there for someone else that wants to bike. Jesus. We're gonna stop and get our helmet on. Again, we're not gonna return the property. I just wanna stop these bastards from stealing shit. 20 I'm surprised. I've seen many like that. I guess, uh... Start random events will reward the player with stat, stat, boots, boosts, or money. I cannot speak tonight. What the fuck? Try to get around this traffic, because we're almost home. It's been a fucking wild day out here on the streets of Los Santos doing a little bike supposed to be nice and relaxing but next thing i know shots fired everything to do with uh <laughs> fucking oh my god life of a biker right there jesus so we'll probably stick with uh, franklin next time we go out that way it's just uh uniformed and we know what to expect the reason why i used that hunter last time is because he had hunting gear and all that fun stuff our green light so yeah, you guys really enjoyed the hunting episode. I definitely want to do more of those because it was super fun. 
even though it was hard to find the game that I wanted. I think it's because of the area I went to. But like I said, you guys gave me some really nice areas, and I can't wait to go and try those out. Ah, here we go. And we're pulling up to uh, Casa, Casa La Franklin. That is not his house. So this one right here. Yep, this one. Shut up, girl across the street who's hooking her, hooker, hookering in front of my house. All right, here we go. Could be a nice, uh, successful arrive with a gun out, you know, because we had to shoot some people on the way. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this one out here on the Pegasi Batty 801, doing some uh, rides around town and stuff. So again, I hope you guys enjoyed, and we will see you next episode. Oh.